Welcome back to Tenorshare. Many people in our comments mentioned that they have a lot of data in WhatsApp and want a better way to back it up in case of data loss. Some people may do it on iCloud, but if you're running out of iCloud storage, or your backup data is smaller than your actual data and it can't back up your data correctly, or you just want a better way to back up your WhatsApp chats, we got you covered. Let's dive right in. First, here is a quick walkthrough of backing up WhatsApp on iCloud. This is simple, you can just open WhatsApp and go to Settings. Then, tap on Chats. Next, select Chat Backup. From here, if you want your videos to be included, you can turn it on. Then, you can click Backup Now to back up your WhatsApp data to iCloud. To restore your backup, just reinstall WhatsApp or set it up on your new iPhone. Log in with the same iCloud ID and WhatsApp account and follow the iCloud restore prompts to restore your chat history. But if iCloud storage is almost full and you have lots of chats, this might not be the best option. And iCloud's automatic backup will overwrite previous data, so you'll only have access to the most recent backup. So now, Let's explore an alternative way to back up your data without storage limitations and auto-overwriting data. Part 2. Using iCareFone Transfer to Backup WhatsApp This tool is specifically designed to back up and transfer message data, like WhatsApp, without relying on iCloud. You can back up your WhatsApp messages on your computer whenever you like for free and manually, and it's easy to restore it. I will leave the free download link below for you guys to try out. Here I will show you how to do this. Download and install iCareFone transfer on your computer, then connect your phone to it. Click trust on your iPhone if prompted by the notification. Then open iCareFone transfer, select WhatsApp and choose backup. This method not only backs up your WhatsApp data, but also allows you to easily transfer chats between devices, view your backups, and even restore them selectively. Then click Backup Now to do a local backup on your computer. It will backup your WhatsApp quickly. If you have lots of data, it might take a little bit longer. Then you can see all your backup files here. This method not only saves your WhatsApp data, but also makes it easy to move your chats between devices, check your backups, and even restore specific messages when you need them. If you do a new backup next time, the earlier backup will also be listed here. It will not automatically delete it, and you can choose to restore it easily. No need to reinstall WhatsApp or erase your phone. OK, some of you might consider using iTunes to back up your WhatsApp data. While iTunes does allow for a full device backup, but your WhatsApp chats will not be backed up along with everything else on your phone. It will just back up the app you have and you can't restore just WhatsApp data from an iTunes backup. It's all or nothing, so if you're looking for a specific backup solution for WhatsApp, this might not be ideal. However, if you do need a full device backup, iTunes is a reliable option. It's especially useful if you want to transfer your entire iPhone data to a new device. So, whether you prefer using WhatsApp's built-in backup, iCareFone transfer for a more advanced solution, or iTunes for a full device backup, you now have all the tools you need. If you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. And if you have any questions or need further assistance, feel free to leave a comment. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.